Well, I'm at the Internor stand here at IBC 2019, and uh, I've got Martin with me. Hi, Martin. Hi, how's it going? Yeah, not too bad. Um, for those who don't know, first of all, tell us a little bit about Intino, and then we're going to sort of move on to the esports side of things. Okay, Intino is a Swedish company. We do lots of uh, esports streaming, yep. and that is mainly based on encoders, routers, and receivers. Okay. Um, yeah, and uh, especially for ESL, it was very interesting to listen to Stephen, yep. um, what he needs, what he wants to do, yep. contribution and distribution, and uh, it's all based on the Intino Direct Router. It's the blue machine. Uh, so the whole concept is based on SDI input, SDI output, routing, protocol translations, yep. that kind of thing, and that makes it so versatile. Great. Great. And it just so happens that we've got Stephen here, so let's move across to Stephen. Hey, Stephen. Hi, how's it going? Yeah, not too bad. So tell us about how ESL are starting to integrate into noise your workflows. Um, right now, it's just the beginning. It's, it's our new partnership where we're going to be using Intenor products for all of our traditional linear deployment. Previously, uh, well, currently and in the past, ESL has always handled, handled its own web deployment ourselves directly. Uh, linear was always something we outsourced uh, to a managed service. And this is the beginning of us kind of stepping away from that for a bunch of reasons. But now we're going to bring it under our umbrella, have direct control, but still have all the the kind of more traditional deployment options that we needed previously from a managed service. So what is it about the internal product line that sort of drew you into them? Um, it, it's a couple of things really. The first one is is really a quality, I guess, because we, we've always stayed away from purchasing hardware. We build a lot of our own hardware and there, we always stayed away from purchasing because the, the quality is never as good as we can get. So that, that's one point. The Intenor encoders are pretty much the highest quality hardware encoders that I've seen and the, the standard in eSports is, is super, super high. So they, they have to meet a pretty high level and they, they achieve that. And the, the other one is the cost. It's we can We can take the a managed service is hugely expensive for us. We have to continuously you know, spend to keep that going. And with Intenor, we can invest in the hardware for a cost that actually like, makes a lot of sense. So we can, we can save money over you know, a three, a five, a 10 year period by doing this, but still have not only everything we had before from the managed service, but even more features, even higher quality, and, and we own the hardware, right? So it's, it's, it's huge benefits for us for doing this. Stephen, thank you very much. I've got to quickly turn back to Martin. Martin, obviously you're here at IBC. People can come and have a look and talk to you about your product range. If they weren't able to come here and see you, is there a website they can go to? Yeah, uh, it's www.intinor.com yep. and you will find all the products. You will find special approaches, solutions to vertical markets. One is eSports, another is sports contribution, for example. Uh, you, you can find that on our internet website, yes. Martin, thank you. Stephen, Martin, thank you very much. You want to find out more about the amazing range of internal products and how they're being used as well at ESL, for example, go and have a look at their website. For more from us here at IBC 2019, don't forget to check out kitplus.com. Mm -hmm.